Here's a question that a student has asked about, and we are going to be classifying costs. It says, indicate whether the following costs of Colgate Palmolive Company and maker of consumer products, which are classified as, would be classified as direct costs, as in materials, direct labor costs, or factory overhead. Well, knowing that Colgate Palmolive, they make soaps and tooth paste and those kinds of things, that's what we're going to be considering. So the scents and fragrances, yes, those would be considered direct materials costs. And of course, the solution to these problems are found under the solutions tab at the uh, website. Wages paid to packaging department employees, that's going to be our direct labor costs because they're actually putting it together. The resins for the soap and shampoo products, again, those are going to be direct materials. Maintenance and supplies, uh, that's going to be our factory overhead because it's not really an integral part of the, the product that we're putting out there. Depreciation on the production uh, machinery, again, that's going to be our factory overhead. F, the salary of process engineers, they're not really working on the product, so that's going to be a factory overhead cost. It's indirect labor. Plant manager salary for the Clarksville, Indiana soap plant, that obviously is uh, factory overhead. All managers are, they're not actually direct labor assembling. The packaging material, and that's where this question is really focused. The packaging material is going to be a direct material cost. The reason being that's going to be the tube that the toothpaste is in and the box that the tube of toothpaste is in. Those are uh, part of that actual material, you know, cap to the toothpaste tube. They're not considering the shipping case, the box that it all all the to tubes of toothpaste are shipped in. So that's a different consideration. So this is actually the packaging material for that product. Bottle of shampoo, it's going to be the bottle and the and the cap to the shampoo. Uh, depreciation, I depreciation on the Morrisville Morriston. Uh, Tennessee toothpaste plant, that's going to be factory overhead, and J, the wages of production line employees, that's going to be direct labor cost. I hope this has helped you, and keep posting questions.